think that we could move to the uh, next demo, which is uh, the, the demo related with the, with the SDK generator. Mm, let me share my screen now. Okay, could you, could you see my, my screen? Yes, yes, we can. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, let me let me continue this this uh, demo round with the with this demo related with the with the SDK the which related with the with the SDK generator. Yeah. First of all, yeah. Um, I would like to to contextualize the the demo uh, uh, using the, the mapping with with our official reference implementation. This demo. Uh, uh, will be contextualized in the context of uh, tax uh, 4.5, uh, which is related with the with the SDK SDK uh, general approach and, and SDK uh, reference implementation. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Trying to introduce uh, um, very quickly the, the idea behind the the SDK SDK generator. Uh, we could we could say that uh, yeah, we, we apply. Um, an innovative approach for the for the SDK uh, SDK nitro market the, for the SDK uh, generator, and the idea is uh, to to provide the uh, SDK uh, follow the approach the, the SDK has a service, and yeah, um, um, for 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 applying for applying this uh, this this approach, we provide and um, um, the idea is provide an open APS specification of one of our uh, backend artifacts. Uh, in addition, or specifying uh, a concrete uh, programming language, and the, the SDK the SDK um, uh, um, uh, service uh, is using the 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 the, the SDK uh, the SDK code manager SDK generator to generate automatically all the the the, the client the client stuff uh, uh, associated with the with the with the uh, with the Open API specification that we we provide uh, as input uh, and. Yeah, we in addition to the API documentation and the SDK generator return uh, all these uh, yeah, all these uh, outcomes as a as it file to the to the uh, invoker. Let me say this is the the conceptual approach behind the SDK generator. And um, finally, um, I would like to show you uh, uh, a concrete example. Uh, as generating sorry. Okay, this is the this is the ROS API behind the SDK generator. And if you keep an eye here, uh, you could see that uh, we have um, uh, is uh, let me say that is simple in terms of, in terms of method, but is uh, is quite powerful in terms of uh, in terms of uh, of outcomes. We have uh, we have this method uh, get supported languages just to to the uh, final user cool check here. The all the, the languages that we we are yes? uh, we're still looking at the slides. Maybe you have to change to the other screen. Oh, sorry. Mm. Okay, you will see my. Uh, the the the, the race API now, Martin. Yes, go ahead. Please. Okay, yeah, sorry for this. Yeah, as uh, as I was uh, explaining, we have uh, a couple of methods. It, it's simple in, ter in terms of methods, but it's quite powerful in terms of the the outcome that the, the SDK generator is, is able to, to produce. In concrete, we, we have uh, this method to get supported languages, uh, and if we uh, execute here, we could see all these huge lists, lists of uh, programming programming languages that are, are we, we are currently supporting in the uh, in the SDK generator. And if we go to the uh, to this method generated SDK, and we try out here, uh, for instance, with the with product here uh, Java. Um, um, let me go for this is uh, this example. Then, yeah, and for instance, if we 
provide here we have to provide the the open api url for um, we are using here the 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 the, the oas of, of the of the backlink api and specifying here that we we, we want to, to generate the, the client client stuff for for your language and if we execute here what we are okay this is the this is the the output and is uh, is the the in concrete, this is the, the C file that I, I show you previously in, in my slide. And if we open the if we open the, the C file, we could see here uh, all the all the client stuff associated to the to the OAS file that in, in, in our sample was the, the, the backplane backplane API uh, open open API specification. Um, always the, the SDK generator is providing for, for you uh, all this, uh, the, the same structure that it is uh, mainly uh, provide the uh, upon file or admin file. But the, the important is that uh, the documentation uh, for, the, for, the, for the generated uh, client, client staff. And if you go to the, to the source uh, uh, folder, you could find here always um, um, yeah, uh, yeah, you, you could you could see here the Okay, you could you could see here, the SDK generator is is always uh, uh, generating the, the same structure. That uh, uh, the the API folder is is quite important because it's is 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 related with the with the controller and is more or less all these classes are are mapping with with all the with all the functionalities with all the method that you could uh, that that you uh, that you want to consume uh, from from the REST API. And the the model the model folder is is containing all the all the all the bins. Let me say all the data objects that are generated automatically, uh, uh, taking taking the uh, the schema the schema part that uh, is, uh, is 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 defining in the in the Open API specification section. And all these bins that you could see here. Are, are extracted automatically from from the from the data schema that are uh, which is is part of the of the open api specification uh, in this case for 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 the backplane yeah and that's uh, that uh, should be all regarding to the to, to the sdk sdk generator and yeah and we, we apply the, the sdk generator uh, to generate the, the the SDK core, which is the the, the next demo in this in this work work, work package for uh, uh, demo demo round. Okay, I think that um, we could uh, move now to the uh, third demo, which is related with the with the SDK core. Okay, let me share with you my. A slice. You could you could see the the, the slice of the SDK core, uh, Martin Aquila. Yes. Okay. Yeah, this is uh, this is the, the third demo that we have uh, scheduled uh, in the context of our package four, uh, which is related with the DSDK the DSDK the core. Yeah. Again, this is the DSDK uh, core mapping to the reference implementation, and the SDK core could replace it in the context of of uh, tax uh, for the five, uh, which is related with the with the SDK, uh, SDK global approach and, and SDK reference implementation. Yeah, the, the, this, is, uh, this is the, uh, let me say a conceptual, uh, a conceptual uh, approach behind the, the SDK, the SDK uh, uh, core. Uh, the, uh, the, the, um, the SDK core is based on, on the on the Ansible Ansible pipeline, and, and as you could see here in, in the in the slide, we are using as a key key uh, key pillar in the in the uh, in, in this uh, in this Ansible pipeline, the SDK SDK uh, SDK SDK generator. The idea is uh, take all the all the all the open API specification of of the of our uh, let me say uh, uh, backend artifacts and generate uh, 
uh, using the, the SDK generator and, and using the, this uh, Ansible pipeline, all the client stuff for uh, that uh, the SDK, the SDK reference implementation are going to need for consuming or for interacting with the, with all with all these uh, all these uh, backend services in, 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 uh, in concrete with with the with the backplane API mainly. This is the, the uh, 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 overview of, of the of the SDK core in terms of uh, of, of pipeline. Yeah, and um, finally, uh, I would like to to show you the uh, uh, complete demo of the of the SDK core. But I would like to show you first. Okay. Could you see my uh, my browser now? Yes. Okay. Okay. This is the. Uh, this is the um, the Ansible uh, A AWX the, the instance the official in for 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 supporting all the all the um, IFI market pipe pipelines and in concrete in the, in the case of the of the SDK core uh, we are we you know, uh, first of all, uh, I would like to, to show you very quickly the, the setup that we have for, for the for the market project. Uh, we have uh, we have uh, several uh, several uh, projects. Uh, each one of them associated with the deployment of a concrete uh, uh, artifact in in IFA market. Uh, in concrete, we have the the I3 market SDK core here. Uh, this is the the, the 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 project associated with the, with the provision of the SDK core uh, pipeline. And this is, is is linking with with uh, with uh, with a, a GitLab project in, in which we, we we have already uploaded all the all the Ansible playbook for the, the execution of, of the of the SDK SDK core uh, pipeline. Uh, um, we have uh, we have several templates. Uh, in concrete, we have a template for uh, for the. Um, uh, for supporting the the, the SDK core uh, pipeline, um, yeah, and for uh, we have uh, we have uh, in this uh, uh, in, in this uh, in this template we, we are using the the for instance the uh, concrete in, uh, physical inventory for for the for the for the IC market uh, that include uh, our four physical nodes in in, in the cluster, and uh, if we if we run an execution. If we instantiate this, this template, uh, we we are going to launch uh, a job, which is uh, which is going to to execute all the all the tags uh, behind the the SDK core. If we run here the the SDK core, you could see. Uh, okay, you could see here the execution. Of the different tags that we have in the in the SDK core, uh, that are, are mainly related with the with the generation of the of the uh, SDK client stuff for the in, uh, in 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 the in the last version we, we are we are generating client stuff for the backplane for sure for the uh, um, OIDC uh, endpoint for the verifier credentials the data data the Data access API and finally for for the notification manager and all the yeah, the, the pipeline is in charge of the generate or um, uh, a couple a couple of version of the SDK core uh, and the first one is is uh, is the JavaScript version which 
which is uh, which is uh, is, uh, is using in the in the our pilot and the the second version of of the of the SDK core is is based is based on, on java and is used in the in the uh, has uh, has a library in the in the SDK in the SDK uh, reference implementation project uh, in, in concrete this uh, this uh, is java version is 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 um, is used or is uh, utilized in the in the IBM and and, and Siemens Siemens pilot yeah, the execution of the the SDK core uh, takes um, several minutes, and I think that uh, yeah, maybe we could come back here yeah, to 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 see the, the the how that the to see that uh, that the, the the job is 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 is, is finished uh, successfully, if if you want. Yeah, and that uh, would be uh, all regarding to the to the SDK core uh, demo. And now I think that it is time to to the uh, to the SDK RI uh, demo. Uh, maybe uh, uh, Kaiser, you could take the, the the floor now and and start with the with the with the SDK SDK RI demo in, in concrete to to show this uh, short scenario uh, uh, related with the with the offering. <laughs> 